Hey YouTube, this is Prometheus, guys, giving you more than meta. So guys, I want to talk about uh, a defensive scheme that I'm most likely going to work on uh, for my patrons, which is going to be the the Dime 3-2 defensive scheme, mini scheme. Uh, this is a defense I didn't even know I was going to be using. When I jumped into this gameplay, I was actually going to be uh, leveraging a penny scheme. Uh, which is a 3-3-5 scheme um, out of the Titans playbook, but I inadvertently, for some reason, the game defaulted to my Houston playbook, and I had to scramble against this opponent, and there's certain things that I like about it, and I've got to get in the lab to go ahead and check this out, so I wanted to share this, this, uh, this quick gameplay with you as I'm scrambling. One thing I want to, want to point out to you, you can find this particular version of it, uh, which is the, the, the Dime uh, 3-2 out of the 46, the 49ers, Chiefs, Jets, Multiple D, Saints, and the Texans. So that's how I got it. I, I use the Texans online. That's my team for now. Uh, that I've been using, uh, but uh, you just this defense is actually a little bit better. So I'm actually <clears throat> going against someone who's playing the Chiefs, something you see right away, and I start looking. Um, I'm setting up my op, my my defense right now, base line options, sprint, uh, tackle, and then all of a sudden I start jumping into my formations, and I'm like, wait a minute, here, where is my penny defense? I've been I've been labbing penny defense, and I I sided. I'm like, I'm gonna quit. I'm like, no, I can I can always lab my offense and maybe I can get a stop. So I'll find something uh, against my opponent. So I literally debated in this game. I said maybe I'm just gonna you know I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna quit because I want to. I I basically been labbing a penny defense and I'm like okay I'm just gonna switch things up. So now I come down to dime uh, and I discover I just use a basic dime defense which is a dime rush defense. And I jump into cover six, and I'm like, okay, let's just go and jump into cover six and see how my opponent uses. And this guy is using a lot of these elaborate motion schemes. Uh, he might be the Miami playbook. I, I'm not sure. I haven't looked at these playbooks right now. I'm still trying to settle into my stuff uh, before I start exploring other playbooks. And you can see he's got these motion stuff. So um, I'm playing around with this, and I jump into, into the 3 2, and I see this these play right here. I see cover four palms. And I see cover six, and I'm like, okay, let's get this go time. These are the defenses I like to run online, so I've got some stuff to work with. And then I see quarters. Uh, there's a lot of good stuff in this formation. So I jump out of quarters as a base defense, and right here uh, you can see he's got a lot of his. He's got a, he's got a bunch formation over here, and I'm just going to kind of rotate my guys over. I think I, I shift my line over because I've got this guy. I've got a run threat off to the left. And I'm still I'm fumbling around my with my uh, my stuff. I actually get myself a little bit out of position with my my lineman. Should be going the opposite direction, but he actually hits a little bubble, and it's actually um, <coughs> basically a pass play. But because I was playing cover four, I had two guys in that that area that could have been picked off based on he's using these uh, you know motion double pass formations and stuff like that. He's using these, these glitchy plays. So now I'm settling in on what I want to do. I put a cover full of palms. Um, he calls a play really quick. I'm going to come out of quarters. Anytime I see quarter, or I see a quarters formation like this, um, I'm see, assuming he might come out of mesh. But now he's using these motion plays. It does a trip stuff, and uh, right here actually dots me up on a little spot route. That was probably the best read this guy does in this entire series with that little dot right there. So he's exploring right now. Uh, he's and fortunately for me, uh, I think he's just testing stuff out, and I'm just trying to find my defense and get things set up. So I got a cover six formation um, there. I probably won't use that a little bit later on, but right here I actually see that the cover six is good. I'm going to flip the cover six, and I'm going to try to flip the cover six because I want to go ahead and play this guy right here because he's got three wide receivers. They're probably going to come out some type of a verticals route which they do and they're all on verticals and you can see right here he checks it down underneath bad read that should have been a completion right there in that type of situation but um some particular reason he doesn't get that off so bunch uh strong nasty uh, still trying to play around with a little and i think i come out of the the, the free star the, the 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 free safety blitz so one standard blitz setup, and you guys have seen this before. You're going to basically take your lines and crash them down. And a lot of times what's going to happen is this, this should get a free uh, uh, lead. I'm going to go ahead and put this guy in a hook zone. I'm going to blitz him down to preoccupy this. And my responsibility is to fall back in the coverage. I hope the pressure comes in. And he goes another one of these little auto directs. And you can see, look at this blitzer comes in clean. 
no pressure and doesn't get picked up and I'm able to go and hit this guy with a blitz. So now I'm in game. I'm thinking to myself, okay, this is what I want to do. I want to have these type of blitz options in the game. Scramble, go ahead and jump into cover four. Get myself on the wrong defender. I should be on this guy carrying across the middle of the field. And he actually light, he actually hits this guy right over the middle of the field and actually gets a nice little completion. So I uh, gets fourth and four situation. Uh, and I go ahead and jump into, uh, I think I'm still stuck in this cover three. I man this guy up right here uh, and basically go ahead and carry over. He goes a little motion play. Once again, he's got a little outside route. Hits me with, a, with inside, inside route right there. So it looks like he's just carving me up on defense, and that's fine. I'm in a defense I haven't lapped. I don't really know uh, know my responsibilities as far as setting things up. I don't have my audible set up. Nothing really lapped. Right here, sending some pressure against him. He drops it down underneath. And I decide, okay, I need to go ahead and bring both my safeties down and disguise my coverage. So in this type of situation, I go into this bigger play, I believe. I think this is going to be a play where I jump into the double safety go. And I want to get my safeties down um, and basically go ahead and make him make, make, force him to make some reads on it. So I do have basically cover uh, a cover four coverage. I go jump into cover four right here, which is a palms coverage. Bunch on my line to kind of show him the blitz. He goes in another one of these little crazy little auto auto motions. And now I'm playing down in the box, and he actually throws right in one of my defenders. I pick him off and get a nice little uh, interception right there because uh, this guy's just kind of throwing things around. Now, I'm not showing you this because this is a great gameplay. Uh, this guy you know, ends up quitting out on me because he doesn't he doesn't want to finish the game out. Uh, but I'm just showing you that, that this particular defense has got some great plays in it, but you still got like that bunch type stuff but you've also you've got you know basically that 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 three two defense that you can use you've got that inside blitz that you can go and throw into your scheme but now you've got cover four shells over the top of it so guys i wanted to show this to you i'm gonna be working on this i'll probably work on this defense it's just another alternative defense that i can provide to my patrons uh to to be a little bit more successful i'll show you some gameplay of this you know if you can get one or two stops in the game you're golden in this game right now uh because defense is just it's so suspect and pretty much people can get away with doing whatever so once again guys thank you for your support if you do like these type of gameplay clips, tips, hit the like, uh, hit the like stuff. I'm going to try to roll out as much uh, defensive gameplay for you guys to take a look at. Uh, until next time.